Hey guys, Noel and Santino here. And Batman here. And Batman here for an exciting video game review for the video game section of the Noel Comics YouTube channel. Today we are going to review Super Mario 3D World on the Super Mario 3D World Bowser's Fury Power Pack for the Nintendo Switch. So uh, we are a good chunk of the way through Super Mario 3D World. Uh, one of my students was telling me that there's uh, eight worlds in Super Mario 3D World, and we are currently on World 7, uh, and we are in the process of accumulating enough stars to get into, you know, King Koopa, a.k.a. Bowser's Castle. So uh, we'll, uh, you know, do a little bit of uh, gameplay and analysis, and uh, a good time will be had by all, hopefully. Uh, so without further ado... Yeah, ho hopefully we can get enough stars to throw this castle. Yes, I think we are at like 107 of 130 needed to get into the World 7 castle. Uh, within each world, there's about, uh, you know, five levels with, you know, uh, about three stars that you have to get for each level. Um, and a la Super Mario USA, aka Super Mario Brothers 2 in America, you know, you can play as Mario, Luigi, Peach, or Toad. So that's good. Get the old Mario USA crew back together. And this game, uh, features the lovable, uh, Cat Mario, yeah, which yeah, is uh, also very yeah, good. Yeah, you know, you know that, yeah, yeah, you know that this controller is acting kind of weird. Yes, that controller is acting kind of weird. Uh, this is a two-player game. And, uh, for some reason, uh, Santino's, uh, wired controller, uh, was not working that well. Uh, but that's okay. No, it's working now, though. Well, that's good. All right, anyway, why don't we, uh, we'll get our, yeah, yeah, we'll get everything thinking, set up. Yeah, yeah, now it's working okay. Well, there you go. So, so when I, so when I got back, it went, we just had right, Let's not mess with, I don't know what you're hitting, buddy, but let's, uh, let's, uh, get out of that. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I don't so. hit a button. All right. Yeah, it's only, yeah, I accidentally hit a button. All right, and here we have... So we have ventured back to World 5 uh, in our quest to uh, get more stars here. Uh, now, this one here, I know we were in a situation where we pretty much uh, had figured out where the last of the three stars were. Yeah, yeah, and this one was really tricky. It is, and this level is tricky because when you jump, it causes the platforms to change up. So you yeah, basically yeah, have to. Uh, yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. This level was such a pain. This level was such a pain. Hold on. Let's you switch. have ah, darn it! Oh no, good. There was a floor there. When, when we switch the lights. Oh man! Yeah, hit the lights, buddy. All right, well done, little friend. All right, let's try this again. Okay, so actually this kind of reminds me of a Bio Miracle uh, Baby Oopa for the Famicom, because we're basically running around on a big cake. Now, think about this level, and all these levels have different things to kind of, uh, yeah, you know, yeah, yeah, we'll get play with. Oh, there you go, buddy. Now you're in. So this is simultaneous two players. So Santino has uh, tagged in uh, Luigi here. Well, I fell. I That's fell. okay. The other fun thing about this game is um, yeah, and, yeah. Another fun thing when you f yeah, another fun thing when you another fun another fun another tricky thing another tricky thing when you fall. And I think we have figured out where the two last stars are. Yes. So, as I was saying, you know, this game features a lot of uh, puzzles that will be uh, challenging and uh, pleasing to the senses. I, I keep... I, I, I keep missing the mushroom. That's okay. Yeah, yeah. Because as long as I'm doing okay, yeah. you'll do okay. Yeah, 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 because, yeah, because, because how do you get that mushroom? How do you get that uh, mushroom? Uh, well, in this case, 
We have one star. Oh, the mushroom. I think you just gotta hit that box there. So we'll just jump and try to. Ah, darn it. I don't want to miss it. Dude, the only thing I don't like about this is sometimes I feel like it takes a minute for the um, punch button to, or the fire um, flower button to register. It's almost like it's not, it's not like an instantaneous uh, firing. Ah, no! Oh no, game over, but we'll be okay. Because we can pick up right where we left off. Now, if you do get a game over um, before you clear the level, say you get a star in a level, you get a, and you like get a game over before you complete that level, you will not get to keep your star. But when you do get a game over, these little slot machines respawn, and then these will give us, you know, the opportunities to, you know, rack up some extra yeah, lives. Yeah, yeah, hopefully we can get an extra life. We are at least going to get one, because we got a match. Wee. Uh, you know, now, I've only beaten the original Super Mario Brothers and Super Mario 64. Um, I'm on my way to beating this game, and I will say that this is probably, uh, the most, um, accessible Mario game I think I've ever played. Maybe tied with the original Super Mario Brothers. That game was pretty darn accessible. But this game, you know, if you ever really find yourself in trouble... Uh, sometimes it gives you these little, uh, invincible, uh, tanuki, um, costumes that pretty much m make it so you can just plow through your enemies, which is nice. Um, really helps you get, uh, you know, lots of stuff kind of hidden in the levels. So, this is a very user-friendly well, Mario, which is not flower, always the case. Look, I got a free flower. Yes, you did. Very good. Spot on, little right. buddy. Wow, no, buddy, don't jump yet. No, ah, jeez. Was... Okay, do not jump. All right. All right, I will jump. But then I jump. Damn it. <laughs> what? What? All right, we have to be careful about coordinating jumps in this level because the ground will disappear on us. Yeah, yeah, those things will flip. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because every yeah. time you jump... Flip. The so you have to kind of psych out the movement of the you gotta predict the movement of the panels here. Like, what I mean, I would I would probably get that flight flower. Here get that oh darn it. Buddy here, get this get that mushroom. Well never mind. I'll, I'll take care of us. Good thing about two player here is that you know one player can pretty much just take the lead. I got I got a mushroom. There you go. Yeah. Then I said there's another uh, Sailor Moon video game for the Super Famicom. Yeah, it had one of those. It had a level that kind of reminded me of this as well. It was like. Hey, come on, how do I jump? How do I jump? How do I jump? You jump by hitting the jump button. Oh, so, oh, so that's how we do it? Yes. Whoa. What is going on, man? Why can't I... There we go. No, no, no. I don't know what you hit, but don't hit that. <laughs> what button did I hit? I don't know. Something about an amiibo. Alright, so we got our little check mark here now. Venturing down that pipe will lead uh, us to a opportunity to get a star, which we've already so, gotten, so, so we're going to not so do that. Of you, so if you push that button, it will take pictures of the game you're playing. Yes. So we're going to jump here and then predict that that's going to move there, which it will. And then we're going to get on top of this so we're safe. And then we're going to make a run here, flip that, flip. jump on that. Jump. Alright. I, uh, I fell through the floor. Oh, oh, that's not close. Alright, hang on a second. If I can get close, that would be easy. Yeah, okay, so there is a. Uh, sorry. Oh, hey, wait, did we meet? We were the other star go. I did it. You did? You beat the level. I thought there. Darn it, I thought there was like a. Um, 
Where was the other star? I thought there was like a little uh, star that you had to go through. And uh, I'm thinking of another level. Darn it. I thought there was a star that you had to go through. And as you jump through, you got gold coins and it would give you a star. Next, next, let's go in that lava all the way there. Okay, well, we are missing a star here, so we'll take a look for you see if we can get our last star here. And we'll probably wrap up the review. Why will we probably wrap up our review? Well, we've been playing for about 10 minutes. Well, Giving the, the viewers a nice but, taste well, we of the wonderful the world of those, Super Mario 3D World. Yes, I know we do. Alright, so wait, get wait. these uh, tiny keys here. Okay. Wait, I, I, I want to get a. The, a miss it. <laughs> get the fire flower, buddy. I, I get the fire flower. There we go. There we go. Now, Tanuki Mario can glide, which is very nice. If you get Tanuki Mario, it's really nice. Uh, the invincible Tanuki, it's really good because. Uh, whoa, whoa, I fell in the lava. Wee. Because then he can glide and pretty much knock Daddy, out anything in Daddy, front of him. Yeah, he actually in the lava. I mean, as long as I've got my life, it should be okay for us here. Whoa. Oh, whoa. Mm. Come at me. Mm. Oh, man. I mean, that's down it. I would have missed that thing. There. No, no, I can't get this thing. Quick. Oh, definitely got that thing. So this is a, not only a fun game to play, but also a fun game to watch. Why well, not a fun game to play? I remember my sister-in-law was over, and she just had a lot of fun watching me and seeing people play this game. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This level's got a nice, uh... God damn it. Darn it. Ah! <laughs> what? Oh man, I was so close. <laughs> what? That's yeah, okay. Yeah, it's kind. Of, it's, it's kind of like you're in uh, like a heist movie or like a, something like that. Like yeah, yeah, uh, something, something these like spotlights like coming at us here. Yeah, yeah, both. yeah. Some, yeah, yeah. Sometimes both. There's also these little fun little stamps you can get, which give you like stickers of different characters, just to kind of like little achievements you can look at. Yeah. Two more, one more, where is it? Get it! No! I got it. I need to get the Tanuki thing. No, no, just go in there. Just go in there. Give it to me. Where is it? Ah! It's really dead. There it is, alright, we got it. Oh, no, no. Luckily, we do have a Tanuki Mario toy, too. No, 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 I need to, no, I gotta get, no, I gotta get, no, I get, I gotta get a belt that's in the cow Uh, I know. We, we just need bells in general. Hey, can you give me a bell? I don't know. Yeah, jeez, darn it, no, no. <laughs> Oof. Okay, we got some extra time here. Oh, yeah, Try to hide out here. Thankfully, we're actually, it's kind of to our advantage that we're so little because we can kind of dodge, why, why, why dodge that got, spotlight here. Why, why do we gotta hide? I, can you, can you, just, can you just give me a bell? Uh, if I can get one. And then, I, and then you can give it to me. If you can, like, just get it about that would be great. Yeah, I mean, I'll try. Oh, uh, uh, man. We, we gotta get out of here. Darn it! <laughs> I'm waiting. This is, like, a very chaotic situation. <laughs> I'm just gonna stop screwing around here and move forward. Forward? If we, if we can go forward, that would be nice. Please tell me that there's a ground there. Well, it looks like there's not. Darn it. <laughs> uh, 
That's what happens in these platformers. Sometimes you're just jumping into the abyss here. Alright, we'll get, uh, give it one more go here. We got one more star here. I don't know where it went. Give me a bell. I'm trying. <laughs> sake. Okay, just about enough of this nonsense here. Man, we, we need to get out of here. Alright, what I need to do is get that last coin there. There we go. There we go. Now, now, we, now what I need to do is just get the, that, that bell so I can climb what? up there. I did, oh, for God's sake. I did, I did jump spinning than I was, than I was supposed to do. I was, I, I had to like jump spinning than I can. Yes. Do I jump spinning than I can? Uh, uh, pain's sake. Oh, man. 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 I did such a pain. Alright, well, I don't know where the other star is here, but we beat the level, so that's good. But we can... No, you beat the level. Well, we beat... it was a group effort, buddy. I couldn't have done it without you. Alright, hooray. Well, there you have it, guys. That is, uh... Yeah. We, got, we got Blue Toad in, in our collection of stickers right there. Yeah, yeah, let's get some... Let's some more levels. We will, but I think that's good for our review right now. So there you have it, guys. That is Super Mario 3D World for the Nintendo Switch. A very fun and exciting Mario game filled with lots of suspense and cuteness and hand-eye coordination what, and what, family fun. Yeah, yeah. When is we supposed to go in Boo's level? Yeah, we can go to Boo's level. There are many levels to explore and enjoy in Super Mario 3D World on the Nintendo Switch. Until next time, guys, I'm Noel, and this is Batman over here, and we will see you in the very near future. Bye-bye.